In this video, you will learn about using Google Classroom as a communication system for students and guardians. The teacher can use Google Classroom to send notifications to student and guardian devices, answer student and guardian questions, and communicate announcements. In this section, you will learn how to add students and turn on their notifications. Students will go to Google Classroom and click on the plus sign and choose Join Class. Many students may already have joined the teacher's classes at the beginning of the year. After students are in Google Classroom, they will need to go to the upper left and click on the three lines. At the bottom of the menu that pops up is Settings. Students will then click on Settings and be directed to a list. They will then click on Notifications. Students will click on the word Disabled. If using a Chromebook, it will then show Enabled. If using an iPad, it will direct you to a Settings page. In the Settings page, students will click on Notifications. After clicking on Notifications, the student will click on the toggle switch and allow notifications. The next section will talk about how to add a guardian. It is important to note that teachers should not give guardians the Google Classroom code that students are provided at the beginning of the year. There is a different way of adding guardians into Google Classroom. On the teacher end, the teacher will need to go to the right top corner in settings in the class. They will have to make sure that the guardian summaries are turned on. In the people section, teachers will need to click on invite guardian next to the student's name and type in the guardian's email address. On the guardian end, they will receive an email and click on an invitation in their mail. They will be given this screen and will be able to choose how frequent they receive notifications. In this section, you will learn how to communicate via comments. On the teacher end, the teacher will need to change how notifications go out in Google Classroom. When in the specific Google Classroom class, go to the upper right-hand corner and click on the settings cog. Under general, click on student can only comment. In an assignment, a student can send a question to the teacher using the private comment feature. This allows the comment to be emailed to the teacher. A conversation between the teacher and student can then occur. Another way to communicate with students is to make an announcement. Teachers will click Create and choose Assignment. Teachers can then make an announcement and have attachments as part of the assignment. From the drop-down menu, teachers can send out to all students, a select group of students, or even one student. Once the announcement is made, the student or guardian will get a notification on their device. Devices that can be used are iPads, Chromebooks, iPhones, or Android phones. The use of Google Classroom is a safe and effective way to communicate with students and guardians. The conversations are saved within Google Classroom. Once the school year is over, the teachers should archive the classroom to maintain records of those conversations.